We are delighted to be here today to mark the launch of St Mary's Campus Tobacco Free Policy. Today is National No Smoking Day and going tobacco free on campus today will help us with the following. To demonstrate that we as healthcare providers recognise that tobacco use is a healthcare issue and as a healthcare setting we represent what embodies living well in our community. The launch today marks the start of creating an environment as part of our plan for a healthy campus where we can support people to live a smoke-free life. Change will not happen overnight and today signifies the beginning of a phased approach where we aim to reduce, minimise and eliminate tobacco use over time. From today we aim to kickstart the conversation that everybody has a right to achieve optimal health. Having a tobacco-free campus allows us all as healthcare workers to take a whole person recovery approach and treat tobacco use as a healthcare issue. We at the campus are in a great position to support Tobacco Free as we have the following. Meaningful buy-in from our campus management team who I represent here today to support our staff members and community alike to live a smoke-free life. We have on-site smoking cessation supports with a dedicated smoking cessation officer. We have free nicotine replacement therapy and stop smoking medication for all staff who want to quit. A dedicated smoking cessation module in the Making Every Contact Count training series is available to educate our staff on how to support their clients with smoking cessation. We also have national support services such as quit.ie and our national free phone quit line. We also have worked towards achieving clear signage to communicate tobacco free messages on campus and have advertised that our smoking cessation officer is available to support people who wish to quit. The benefits of going tobacco free will begin immediately. We at St Mary's Health Campus are motivated to make a huge difference to individuals' health and contribute to the wider context of population health when it comes to being tobacco free. My name is Miriam O'Shea and I am the Smoking Cessation Officer based here at St Mary's Health Campus. I'm delighted to be here today at the launch of the Tobacco Free Campus. We have a staff initiative where free nicotine replacement therapy is available to all staff and you can get support from me during your working day. Please give me a call if you would like to avail of support in quitting at this time. Using nicotine replacement therapy has been shown to double a person's chances in quitting and by getting support you can double your chances again. Today is the National No Smoking Day. Traditionally a day when people who smoke begin their journey to quit. I can think of no better day to mark the launch of St Mary's Tobacco Free Campus Policy. As one of our Healthy Ireland priority programmes, the Tobacco Free Ireland programme aims to mobilise the health service to improve health and wellbeing and play its part in the achievement of a reduction in smoking prevalence to less than 5% of the population by 2025. This programme is underpinned by the vision of Healthy Ireland to achieve improved health and wellbeing for all in society. The programme aims to denormalise tobacco use for the next generation, encourage, promote and support smokers to quit through our quit campaign, develop our cessation services and training of our staff, protect our service users and our staff alike from the effects of secondhand smoke, promote tobacco free environments. Launching St Mary's tobacco free campus policy today provides our staff with an opportunity to begin to integrate the topic of tobacco use into the wider recovery journey of the people who use our services. The level of public awareness of the negative impacts of smoking and secondhand smoke on physical health is extremely high. Unfortunately, tobacco use is still the leading preventable cause of death and illness worldwide. Today marks a moment where we are sending a message as a centre of excellence in community health that people can quit successfully if they are given the right supports in the right place at the right time. Achieving this will require the commitment of all staff on campus to come together with their clients to explore the issue of smoking and recovery. Internationally, Ireland is regarded as a trailblazer in relation to workplace smoking ban, and many countries have followed suit since then. We now need to demonstrate the same level of leadership in relation to smoking in the health service, and prioritise the physical health of both our staff and the people who use our services. Today's launch represents a step towards taking responsibility for driving our policy priorities in the area of tobacco control at St Mary's Health Campus.